one of the like most often questions you know that um, uh, that we get often is how do we avoid crutch words? Like those. <laughs> That's right. You know, the funny thing about crutch words is when you have a crutch, you actually need it because you have a hurt leg or something. You don't need crutch words. They're just habits. And really, we have to think about what they're for. All they really do is just give our brains just that split second it needs to be able to catch up. Sometimes our mouths get a little ahead of our brains. You love all those crutch words. Um, so <laughs> well, I don't like, like using them. Well, you know, but you, you like picking them out sometimes. I know I had the hardest time when I was in college. I said fixing to all the time, fixing to. Finally, a friend pointed it out, stopped it like that. So the first thing you have to do is become aware of you saying those crutch words. So when you feel it coming, you can try to pause. Nothing wrong with the pause. Now, in the middle of a sentence, maybe a little different, but between sentences, between thoughts, pause for just a second. A lot of times that just adds emphasis to what you're saying. And it will avoid those crutch words so that it gives your brain just that time to catch up and lets you continue in that conversation. Another thing you want to be thinking about is you want to try to make this just part of your everyday conversation mm -hmm. so that it's not just when you're presenting that you want to try to avoid these crutch words. It's all the time. Just kind of make it your everyday way of life. If you'd like to be able to get more videos like this with tips and tricks, be sure to join our newsletter at barnstmedia.com or subscribe to our YouTube channel.